Hello and welcome back to Insert Name of Show here, aka Inosh. Unfortunately, due to me watching Vice Network perpetually and them having barely any commercials, if anything, I was not able to really get as much ammunition as I wished. But I did see a commercial that was rather stupid. It is just as old as, if not older, than the commercial we had last week. But it's something, you know. So, you know, I, I'm going to get back, you know, on the horse. I'm going to watch some more mainstream television programming to get, you know, better ammunition for commercials for us to tear apart for your viewing entertainment. I am AO. I'm here with uh, Miniature McPinkerton. Don't make fun of me! <laughs> and anyway, uh, so we're here to review uh, Toro's all-wheel drive motor TV commercial. Um, for link to the uh, for links to the original video, the host um, the host net uh, channel or the the host uh, yeah channel is it channel yeah YouTube channel the host yes. channel um, all that stuff is in the underbar all the credits and stuff is in the underbar and anything uh, without any further ado uh, let's watch this. What are we watching? Why is the volume off? I remember seeing this commercial. Building a greenhouse on a hill wasn't the best decision we ever made. <laughs> Building a greenhouse on a hill. But I did get one thing right. Introducing the hill climbing oh, power of the new Toro commercial. <laughs> and the redesigned easy to use zero turn oh, like, tractor. I've seen Toro. this commercial somewhere. Home Depot. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh my god. That was a good commercial, though. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that was a good commercial. It is a good it's commercial. It's not like every other commercial. Yeah. yeah. Any every other commercial you see out there, this one was funny. It was good, and it got my attention. Yeah. <laughs> I have no, uh, I have no, like, anything negative to say. It was pretty thought out. Yeah, I, I don't really have much, you know, other than like, you know, maybe they should have hired a better contractor to build their, you know, their house. You know, it's it's their own fault. They wanted a house there. <laughs> I know, but like, you know, you'd think that they would figure out how to put the appropriate foundation. I mean, it's not that difficult. Like, if something's at that steep of an angle, you can see it with the naked eye. You don't even need one of those levels with the little, like, bubble floating around. Like, it's, like, this, here, let's let's go back to the, to this house. I think they just didn't want their house on stilts. Or they could have, like, they could have, like, excavated the land to make... To make it better, like, like I know that's not the point of this commercial. Where's the damn house? There it is. Excavating but land I think would one be thing. more expensive, I think. It depends on the house, though. You know what? Wait a minute. Are those trees lined up, or yeah, those trees are straight? Because it looked like they just took the camera and just angled it to make it look like the. Uh, <laughs> but no, like those trees are straight. So this is um. This is really good editing, actually. To to. To make the house angled like that, to and flow it in seamlessly with uh, with the trees to make it like, you know, like like they actually like you know, seamless did or something. I, that's I wonder how they did that. <laughs> it's trickery, isn't it? Yeah. Because <laughs> that that's that's damn impressive. Right. Introducing the hill climbing power of the new hill Toro all-wheel drive mower and the redesigned easy-to-use zero-turn tractor Toro. Still though, why would you put a house on a little hill? Honestly. <laughs> well, why would you put a house on a hill and build it like that? Like honestly, I I think this was a very bad commercial to choose for us to review. But I didn't really have anything, and as I said earlier, I've been watching Vice Network now because <laughs> it's actually a good channel, and it's not you know full of just the same crap as any other channel. But unfortunately, <laughs> to do this show. I have to subjugate myself back to the normal crap again. <laughs> um, do you have anything to add? I don't want to add anything. <laughs> All right. Well, second video, and you know, oh, man, it's kind of a flop. Though. But we'll have a better video for next week. For this commercial, though. <laughs> yeah, it's ridiculous. I like how the pots on there don't move though. Yeah, actually, the pots don't friggin' move. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's go back and let's. Uh, so let's see. What else does not fall over? Not all those stuff fell over. But what about right here? Yeah, all the um, all this 
all this toiletries the, and stuff on the counter. On the counter on the right side of the woman's arm. What? No, that's... Oh, there goes something. Yeah, the, the, the pot is, like, somehow glued to the, um... To the, uh, to the stove there. It could be, um, candle wax. Dried candle wax. Yeah, but, like... Angled. Hmm. Because you can get, like, solid... Solid candle wax or clear. Hmm. In different colors. So it's easy to do that and manipulate. What I'm thinking of... Well, wondering about is, uh... Is, like... Did they... Like, why aren't the mirrors, like, angled, like... More like that? You know, or did they, like... Did they, like... There's hammer circles. in the nail, like, this way, and then just, like, have it... They're circles, though. Yeah, but, like, gravity would still, like, have the mirrors, like, They're off... probably the ones that are built in all the way around it. Mm. Like, glued in. Because mm -hmm. it's a medicine cabinet. Why would it be hanging? Well, that's not a medicine cabinet. It could be. Well, that is a pot potential. Never that's seen a circular medicine cabinet, though. I have. Huh. A giant one. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Okay, so it looks like all the stuff on the shelves are all leaning over there. There's a picture over here. Oh, well, I don't have the mouse cursor captured, so you don't know what I'm pointing at. But, uh, huh. it's like, well, where's, where's, uh, here? If you just look just in there that way, there's, like, a gray thing hanging just from the top. It's, like, a picture that's, like, skewed and stuff. Oh. Uh, now, hold goes, on a second. There goes the cop. <laughs> How come the cup went, but but that thing next to his arm didn't? <laughs> or the toast, or the plate. I mean, I guess this Kleenex box or whatever that is, she has her arm on it. No, she doesn't. Building a dream house on a hill wasn't the best decision Bye. we ever made. <laughs> but I did get one thing right. Introducing oh, the hill climbing. Ridiculous. Well. <laughs> she was false. Ridiculous. <laughs> so, uh, this commercial's a good one. You know, I, I, we can't really do much about it. Like, it's a good one. Like, it speaks for itself. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, yeah, I know we, we, or I, when I, when I first, it's blah, 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 blah. When I first started the show last week, the whole purpose was to tear them apart, but it doesn't hurt to have a commercial every once in a while, even if it's the second video in the series. A commercial that's actually good. Like, um, you know, it gets the point across in an entertaining way. It's not wasting my time. You know, it does bring up some decent speculation when you watch the commercial a couple times. Like, why isn't why isn't that thing on the table, you know, sliding, but the, the coffee cup is, you know, in this picture right here. But, uh, this is a good one, dude. This is a good one. Like, I, I'd, I'd buy it if I had the money, you know. You know why certain things don't fall off? Because they have uh, those rubber rubber things on the bottom of everything. To yeah. where they stay. Yeah, but at that... don't slide. That's like a 45... De no, it's not a 45. That's like a 30 degree angle. So... So they have rubber, uh, rubber things on the bottom. So no, they slide they'd still slide. On everything, no. You know those door, rubber door stoppers? It's basically like that on the bottom of everything. Yeah, but like... So it won't, won't slide. Well, if 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 little miss can't figure out how to buy a house, a dream house, can slide out of her bed. This is both ever their faults. They both have to think about it. Well, I'm talking about her. Like, you know, I'm like, you know, I'm saying like if little miss can't figure out how to buy a house, slides off of her bed at that velocity. Hang on. Rewind. Rewind. How far? How far. Uh, to their bed. Um, to their bed. Like where you just see the outside of their bed. Building a dream house. She fell. Yeah, but see, the thing is that she's wearing clothing, and and even at at that at that angle and stuff, all the friction between her skin, her clothing, and the sheets and the bed and everything will prevent her from slipping like that. Well, if she's slipping like that at that velocity, then there's no matter there's no amount of, of rubber you can have. The hill was trying to see something. Cause she find. fell. She fell forward off. But what's this right here? On is this like the wall? No, no. It's just like that's like like a, a large like regal bed with uh, with like drape uh, tap not tapping drapes and stuff around it. It almost looks solid though. 
No, it's it not. It wasn't it's the best decision we ever made. But I did get one thing right. Introducing the helicopter. Oh, there's a right there. The power of the <laughs> drive mower. And the what would have been funnier is if we heard, like, right as she, uh... Right as she, uh... <laughs> this is terrible. Right as she, like, like slid out. But, like, before we heard the thump, like, we just hear, like, the breaking of glass. And then, like, it, it goes to the outside view and she's just, like, flying through the window. <laughs> No, like, no, 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 it wouldn't be like that. It's her falling through on down the hill everywhere in the house. <laughs> she's falling. She's falling up the stairs due to the angle of the house. She's like, <laughs> just falling everywhere. Perpetual, everywhere in the house, all the way outside, falling. all the way outside, all the way outside, <laughs> all the way into the lawn. It wasn't the best decision we ever made. <laughs> He just looks at her like, no, well. Oh, well, goodbye. I'm going to bed. <laughs> Guess you're sleeping on the floor tonight, bitch. <laughs> Other than that, I think that would be it for this thing. Yeah, I think we're good. So, uh, anyway, uh, that's it for Einosh. Uh, I know it's not a really good show, but hey, it's better than nothing. But uh, next week is going to be a lot better because I'm going to subjugate myself to more trash TV to bring you more content. So I'm going to suffer for your entertainment. I bet you appreciate that. Uh, so for all of you and all of us, I'm Ayo. I'm Ayo Frank Rizzo. And uh, Toodles. And stay fancy out there. There you go. There you go. This stupid video. Lock in. Yeah. <laughs>